Hey, what's going on everyone? This is our reviews back with another video and as you probably know with iOS 18 Apple has added some amazing customization features to the home screen now with these features you can now create some really awesome setups on your device now the ability to actually place your icons anywhere you want on the home screen of your iPhone will allow you to do a lot more with the home screen and will make your home screen look totally different so in today's video i will show you guys a few different ideas on how to create some really amazing setups on the home screen of your ios 18 device and we're starting with the split view so this is actually really awesome and it looks really clean now with the ability to also remove the labels from the home screen icons this just takes it to another level it looks much much cleaner so here's what you need to do to create the setup it's pretty simple just move the icons to the one to one half of your device so either the left side or the right side so we'll have two columns of icons here and then get a split wallpaper so this is pretty simple just head on to google just search for iPhone split wallpaper and you will find a ton of these wallpapers that will look really good on the home screen of your device. It splits the screen in half. Now the one side where there's just like a solid color you can place your icons. The other side where you have some kinds of like graphics or something like that you can just leave it empty. It actually looks really awesome. Now of course to get this look you also need to go here to edit and then go to customize and from here make sure that you use large icons this way it will actually remove the labels from the icons and make your home screen look much much cleaner now the next one will be a really really simple setup now what i've done here i just used black wallpaper all black and then what we have here is a widget now this is from widget which is an app that you can download for free from the app store i will leave it linked right down below in the description of the video if you want to get it on your device and i will leave this widget link too if you like it so you place the widget now of course you can place it anywhere you want on the screen it doesn't have to be lined up at the top right there and then what we have here is of course the dock icons and just above the widget we have another row of icons similar to the dock of course a few apps that you use more frequently you can have them here leave this this place right here the space right here all blank and it looks really awesome now with widget what's really cool is that lately with an update they have updated the, their app so they the widgets that you add from widget don't actually show here any label so that's really nice also with the new feature of ios 18 you can actually remove now the labels from the home screen icons as well and this actually makes the icons look really really good now what i would suggest you do here because we have this black background they of course look much much better in the dark mode make sure that you switch your icons to the dark mode so you go to the edit mode here tap on customize and then just choose dark here and you're good to go you will always have your icons on the dark mode and they look super clean now very similar to that one but without a widget we have another setup we will have just the icons in the middle of the screen again i'm using here black background it looks much cleaner but of course you can use any other background you want so what you're getting here is basically you will have here 12 icons on the home screen you just place them in the two middle columns right here you will have the dark here again if you use a darker background i suggest that you actually go with the black icons and remove the labels for a much cleaner look again to do that pretty simple you go to customize you choose dark here and then you switch right there to large and you will have a really nice looking home screen which is also very clean and you will have a bunch of icons here probably the apps that you use most daily you can actually have them right here and of course you have a few on the dock whenever you need other apps you will have the app library just there now here's another one that's pretty cool this one is where you can just place your icons around a subject on the wallpaper like this one right here now, of course the setup that you have on your device will be different based on what kind of subject you have here whether it's like in the landscape mode or mode or portrait mode however it is you can just now simply 
choose to place your icons around that object or subject that's on that wallpaper. Like you can see this one right here, this looks really nice. It has this like painting in the middle, then we have a dark background here. Again, with the dark icons, they look really, really nice. No labels at all. And you will have just the icons here surrounding the subject. It actually looks really nice. So if you have like maybe a family picture or a picture of your pet or something like that, you want to just make it stand out in the middle. You can just leave that space where the subject of the picture is. You can just leave it empty and it looks really good. Again, all you have to do is just surround the subject of the wallpaper with icons. Go to the dark mode on the icons, remove the labels. You will have a really nice look. And last but not least is this setup right here. Now this is one of my favorites. Now to do this, you will have to use some wallpaper of this kind where you will have like a solid color here and then another color right there at the top. This one looks actually really good and it's a very, very nice for this setup that I'm about to show you guys because this setup is not finished yet. I will show you guys how to do that. But if you just want this wallpaper, I will leave a link right down below in the description of the video. So what we're doing here is just having a simple setup. A wallpaper, we have four icons in the bottom row. We have the dock here, but I won't leave the icons here on the dark mode. What we can do with iOS 18 now is go to the edit mode, go to customize and choose tinted. Now you can see what iOS 18 does. It actually will automatically pick the like standing out color of that wallpaper and it will tint the icons based on that color. Now what's really good with this feature is that all the icons will be tinted. Even if you're using like third party apps, you can place them here. They will have their icons tinted as well. And you can see with this like wallpaper and with this tint, it looks really nice and very, very clean. Again, you can pick the color manually if you want to, but you don't have to do that. iOS will do that itself. As you can see, it's the same thing. And it actually looks much, much nicer like this. A very simple, very minimalistic, but again, a very cool look on your iOS 18 device. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. These are some of the best setups you can create on the home screen of your iOS 18 device right now. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully, if you're enjoying iOS 18, if you have installed the beta on your device. So leave a like if you enjoyed the video, subscribe for more videos, and I will see you on the next one.